I can't believe how easy this War Factory looks. Skull Army and friends. Yeah, we're going to crush it. Hello, Skull Army and friends. Skull Crusher here. It is Thursday, October the 29th, 2020. And yes, my friends, we are coming right back at you with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, we will be taking a shot at War Factory. This is something that I don't normally cover, but I think I am going to get back in the habit of it here. We're going to be doing a Warrior Solo on War Factory here. Now, we are still unboosted statue-wise, but we are still taking full and I mean full advantage of the warrior tribal boost from the ever spike tribe once again if you've been living under a rock for these last couple oh the fire spike tribe my bad the fire spike tribe warrior damage still at plus 55 plus 45 percent on skull crusher I can't seem to get that to the full go on this account we are just killing it with my other account because that tribe boost is at 55 percent but here we we go guys so we are going to be relying on the boost from the fire spike tribe but if we do go back to my main island i do want to show you as well the statues are not boosted we are rocking a three seven two three gumboat energy seven troop damage with two troop health so this is actually a very very good operational statue lineup here i think it's gonna make very very quick work of war factory as well so here we go guys let's do this we are going in we're gonna scout this for one more moment here we've already scouted so it's not like we can jump in for the no scout attack here but check in the range of this beach i believe this is going to be a hot beach because i am going to drop on the right side here Few more doom cannons up there shock blaster not too much to worry about i think we can easily easily manage it and once again the health on the actual headquarters is only you know 140 plus 442,000. this is uh this is like, you know, 580 something thousand here. This is actually not that bad. We're going to make very, very quick work of this power core. Guys, before we do dive on in to the attack, remember, do not forget to leave a like on today's video. If you are new and you are digging this content, consider subscribing, ring that bell, and yes, stay notified for when I go live and upload awesome Boom Beach content. School Army, we are 149 subscribers from 5K. We are on the road. We got War Factory. We got Warriors let's do this the attack has started all right now i know my first concern is going to be mines around the core here more so with the boom mines than anything else actually i think only these ones are going to be a big threat so we'll drop one artillery right there and you know what i think we're going to leave the rest of the mines here because we'll easily just kind of be able to drop a med kit when our warriors get into position here just to be on the safe side here i think we will drop one more artillery right here clear up that boom mine regular mine and let's do this we'll start off with bullet and we'll do a vertical staggered drop from the far right side of the beach here like this so we're gonna do a two smoke drop and we're gonna meet up right on the cannon here so it looks like we did a very great job on the vertical stagger drop meet up at the cannon for the halfway point and we'll transition with a ground flare going directly in front of the power core here so now we're gonna reverse our drop here warriors first then the flare point there so we just went power core then flare point we're going to follow up with a direct flare to the power core now cycle our med kit they get some healing in there we're going to activate taunt warriors will show first then bullet and taunt three shocks is all we're going to need here taunt is activated warriors are in position we did actually miss one of those flamethrowers but these warriors are making very quick work of this war factory bringing the hammer down and we continue the week of the warrior i think that vertical staggered drop made a very very big difference right there that was amazing i'll take it guys what'd you think of that one right there do not forget to leave a comment on today's war factory solo with the mighty trusty vikings i'm kidding that's what Amy calls him there. I, I don't mind that name. Um, the Savages, the Warriors coming out to play here. Once again, one cloth's flapping in the air, swinging that mighty hammer, bringing it down. And these Warriors just made a very, very quick work of War Factory here. Sorry, Captain Everspark. You fought a well, but it's a doomed effort. Come on. 
years, my friend. Don't listen to her, Commander. The tide of the war is a turning. So there we have it, guys. War Factory, boom, goes the dynamite with the benefit of the boosted Fire Spike Tribe, the warrior damage. And look at that beautiful sight right there. We've got a Mega Crab Shadow, which means less than 24 hours, less than 20 four hours skull army and we've got the halloween mega crab i know you're excited i know i'm excited i think everybody is excited i'm super excited because i'm going to be going for a, a legendary two halloween trophy there's my legendary one our plans are to convert that to a legendary two so it's going to be a legendary two halloween mega crab push boom goes the dynamite well all right school army and friends we will officially be wrapping up the video remember smash that like remember if you're new smash that subscribe ring the bell stay notified for when i go live and upload awesome boom beach content remember do not forget to use a creator code support code skull crusher in the in-game shop when making any purchases any diamonds any admiral keys any instant tradings well, my friends, we will officially be wrapping up the video. I think it's time to make like a Tom and cruise. Have a wonderful day, everyone. We'll see you later. Peace!